Leaders are urging calm, but Dallas is a city on edge as it approaches the first Ebola incubation deadline this week. Tensions rose a bit this morning when Texas Health Presbyterian Hospital Dallas announced that Ebola patient Thomas Eric Duncan has died. It is with profound sadness and heartfelt disappointment that we must inform you of the death of Thomas Eric Duncan this morning at 7.51 a.m., Texas Health Resources spokesman Wendell Watson said in a statement. Our professionals, the doctors and nurses in the unit, as well as the entire Texas Health Presbyterian Hospital Dallas community, are also grieving with his passing. We have offered the family our support and condolences at this difficult time. Several residents of the neighborhood where the first U.S. diagnosed case of Ebola was found told city officials they'd been sent home from work. Some community volunteers shunned a nearby after-school program and the hospital at the epicenter of the fear acknowledged for the first time that some patients were staying away.